What's up, everybody? Um, I started typing this out. This is my story about the time I got someone calling my boss because I memed them too hard. Um, it was way too long. It was like three million words, and I needed photos and stuff. So I figured it'd be better for my work ethic and your attention span if I just made a video, which is probably not going to go too well because I've never done it before, and I'm probably going to be extremely awkward in front of the camera. But whatever, we'll give it a shot. So, when I was in high school, I had a job at Harvey's restaurant. It was like, it was an okay job. You know, I worked in the kitchen and I was away from people. Near the end, it started to get a little too rocky because I got into it with management occasionally because I memed too hard. I was a bit of a dick. Anyway, so around early 2014, there was this billboard in the town that said like something about some play and it said more fairies than St. John's on a pride week which like was obviously extremely offensive to a lot of homosexual people and some people just didn't agree you know but Oz FM the radio station posted a picture of the billboard with the caption what are your guys thoughts on this and that was the worst thing that they ever could have possibly done ever um but there was a lot of controversy because Newfoundland is full of bigots and like things were getting super heated in the comment section and like someone I know was arguing with this guy and he was like I'm gonna kill you if you don't agree you know all this stuff it wasn't that extreme I'm exaggerating obviously you're gonna see a picture of it in a minute but he flipped out basically because the person I knew said hey that's offensive it shouldn't be posted on a billboard and I just made this stupid meme about this one guy who was like, you know, making all these threats and stuff. And I posted it in the comment section. And he didn't say anything to me. He didn't even message me. He didn't like the comment. He didn't respond in any way. So I was like, whatever. I forgot about it. And I was supposed to be working 5 to 10 the next night. And an, about an hour before work, I got a call. And someone had called my manager and told him that I like made this derogatory photo and posted it on Facebook and I was like spreading slander um the manager basically said like yo piss off this has nothing to do with our company so why are you telling us and the dude like flipped out and he like called back numerous times and each time like the manager was like dude there's nothing we can do just like leave it alone drop it you know what what do you expect so the dude calls up head office and he's like yo some employee at this harvey's restaurant made a meme about me and he blasted my ass too hard and i'm sad and the manager won't do anything about it you know he's like he's saying that you can't control employees facebook but i know you can all this crap and head office basically also tells him to piss off because what are they supposed to do so yeah, it just ended like the dude blocked me on Facebook and like basically all the management at work was like, did you say anything about Harvey's? And I was like, no, nah, man, like I literally was just satirically trying to make this dude look like an idiot. And he basically did that for himself. Yeah, that was a bit of an anticlimactic end to the story, but I mean, I didn't really expect to be making a video about it. I didn't expected to be this like thing that I was gonna spend my night doing I thought I was just gonna make it into a status but I'm just too lazy for that but like regardless I have lots more stories if you guys want to hear more maybe you don't I don't really care but like I've had all kinds of stories that I've figured are too long for Facebook but like they're my favorite stories to tell there's one about a former student that I had school with who like tried to kill me a bunch of times that's a good one. So if anyone wants to hear those, just let me know and I'll record it for you. Peace.